Ever thought your company's CIO and CTO are like urban planners for a digital city? Let's decode these roles and see how they build the tech future. You wake up one morning and it hits you. You have no idea what the CIO and CTO people do in your organization. Let's go down to the basics. CIO stands for Chief Information Officer. Think of the grand architect of our digital city. They focus on the infrastructure that power the city, all the connection points, the sewage system, which would be like data management, the electric grid, which would be like information technology. They're the visionaries that ensure that the city's inhabitants, which are like the company and its employees and contractors, have everything they need to live, work, and play. CTO stands for Chief Technology Officer. They're the chief engineer, always tinkering with the latest gadgets and gizmos. They're the ones bringing to life the flying cars, which is like new and innovative software. They invent robotic dogs, which is cutting edge hardware. Think of a mad scientist, an inventor of sorts. They keep the city ahead of its time. Together, they make sure the digital city is not only running, but also evolving. The CTO usually reports to the CIO, which usually reports to the CEO. I'm Corel, your CTO for this video. We're looking at my role and the role of my nemesis. I mean boss, the CIO. So who are you? You're the construction worker, creating the bricks and mortar that builds the city's infrastructure under the guidance of the CTO, while you occasionally bump into the grand architect, the CIO who's essentially busy surveying the land and planning future expansions. You turn to the CTO when the code doesn't compile. They're the technical expert. The CIO is a bit like the mayor, making sure the city's growth aligns with broader visions. They are the strategy expert. Imagine the CTO arguing for the invention and installation of anti-gravity trash cans to keep the city clean, while the CIO carefully plans the city's expansion into the cloud. Choosing between a CIO and a CTO strategy is like considering options in a digital cityscape. Each choice reflects a different path to innovation. The CTO is more likely to be fascinated by the idea of deploying autonomous vehicles for ultra-efficient door-to-door -door transportation, dreaming of seamless travel for every citizen directly to the destination. On the other hand, the CIO would be more likely focused on implementing a comprehensive city-wide smart transportation network, ensuring reliable, accessible transit options for all the residents, regardless of where they live in the city. The key takeaway is that both roles are about making life in the digital city better, but from different angles, with one eye on the present and the other on the future. The CIO focuses on leveraging information technology to meet enterprise objectives, while the CTO leads the technology or engineering department, adopting new tech to improve products or services. Hang on, don't forget to check out these two other mysteries of the programming universe. The top video is especially picked for you by the powers that be, maybe the CIO themselves. The bottom is our latest upload, created by none other than your CTO.